Trevor Duke with First Mate Yacht Care with the Chicago Boat Show. We're at Masterpass booth right now, and we are on the Parks Edition. Uh, Parks Bonifay is a pro rider. Uh, he's done a, a lot of really cool wakeboard stuff over the years. He's now working for Master Half. They tend to do that, Zane Schwank, Parks Bonifay. Um, this is a Parks Bonifay Edition, so they take an X-Star and they really soup it out. Any option you can imagine, this boat has. Uh, while I'm sitting here, I'm going to show you the big system. This is their onboard entertainment. Right now we're looking at the ballast. Obviously we don't have any ballast full while we're in the convention center. I can go right to the gauges. This tells me my tack, uh, water temp, it's 80 degrees in here, uh, depth, speed, air temp, giving you your tack, you know, good for when you're pulling. This is the Perfect Pass. Perfect Pass has also come a long ways. It's all digital now. Uh, obviously, I don't have a lot to do while I'm sitting here, but I can take a look at my ballast at a glance, my trim, and set my uh, cruising speed for pulling. Also, the audio, I'm not going to crank the audio right now, but you have all your entertainment right here. A small remote, so if you're staring at the Perfect Pass and you just want to tweak the volume, you can play with that here. I believe there's also a remote coming off the back. Uh, so that's really nice that you got a big, bright screen. If you're at night, you don't have to deal with uh, anything like that. Uh, going through the boat, you have this really cool, very, very modern, edgy scheme. Parks has a name all over it. There are JL speakers all over the place. We got these 45 inch speakers, those tweeters in every corner of the boat. We had to turn down the music because it was so loud when we got here. Um, going through here, oh, up here, over the years, Mastercraft has changed their bow, so rather than having a needle bow, like they do on some of the more traditional boats, they're splitting it up here. It gives you a lot of room for sitting people up there, really comfortable. This boat, if you look in here, not only do we have uh, the brains for the remote on the big, but we also have this uh, video device. This takes a video feed from none other than up top on the tower. Looking back at the tower, you're going to hook your tow rope up here when you're wakeboarding, and if you cut to the port side, the camera follows you to the port side. Same going starboard. So if you're catching air, this camera is following your every move. And it's real nice. I think it just pulls to an SD card. You pop that out, look at your ride videos, tweak your ride. Uh, coming down here, Mastercraft has recently partnered with Ilmore. This is an Ilmore. The model is a MV8, so it's a eight-cylinder, six-liter engine. Ilmore has a pretty illustrious history of doing both uh, race boats on the water and doing a lot of NASCAR stock car engines. So uh, I think Ilmore is a, a big step from the old GM engines that they used to put in here. A very, very impressive boat. All the fabric, you know, this quilted pattern here, real cool, edgy uh, graphics on the transom. Very nice. Uh, the sticker on this boat is just north of a hundred grand, but I think that comes with a free session with Parks Bonifay. You get tickets to the Pro Wakeboard Tour. He takes you for a ride on your new boat, throws in probably a Parks Bonifay autographed wakeboard. It's a pretty, pretty darn cool thing. If you had an 18 year old son who liked wakeboard and, and he got to hang out for a day with Parks Bonifay on his new boat, that'd be real cool. Uh, just wrapping up. This tower here, obviously a really well-built tower, we got the boom tubes so you can listen to uh, whatever you're jamming to on your ride. The wakeboard reacts, we can uh, swivel the wakeboard reacts in, you know, I should have prepped this before the video, but you can swivel that in to get your board without having to reach around and drop your board. Also, this large shock here, this is uh, the power tower, I think they call it, it will articulate down. If you're going under a bridge, if you got a low boat house, maybe you have a cover that you want to just drape over it. This will come down to, apparently, right down to the boat. So you can get under pretty much anything the windshield can get onto. This is a very impressive boat. It'd be a lot of fun to be on. And I think it really shows Mastercraft being edgy on the mark, staying ahead of the curve. Uh, looking around, we got the Chicago Boat Show. It's Saturday. It's a good day. See you at the next show.